three ways and through to the first round for the first time, your reaction to the game? Oh, obviously delighted to win. Um, I suppose with cup competitions, it's not so much about performance, it's about result, but um, we played well, we deserved to win, I thought. Um, could have been more comfortable than it was, but regardless, we're, we're through and we look forward to a, a see what we get on Monday and, and then focus on the um, league game at Stockport on Tuesday. Josh Orson got his first goal for the club today in his second game. Uh, how have you, how pleased have you been with his, uh, his start to his foul career? Yeah, really good. He's, he's done well. Like, like I said, after last week's game, he'll only get better um, with the more minutes he plays. Um, so for him to get a goal is great. Um, came at an important time for us. <clears throat> Unfortunately, we, we can well concede a good goal from their perspective, not so much a good goal from our perspective, because we knew there'd be a threat off set pieces. and. Um, we asked, would, could we defend and be this disciplined with against North Ferriby and limit the amount of free kicks we gave away? So, to concede in the, in the, in the way we did was a little bit disappointing. Although, from their perspective, it, it's a good strike. Um, and then, second half, we looked for a reaction. I think first half, although we were comfortable in the game, had a lot of the ball, that we moved it too slowly um, and allowed them to regain the shape and, and be difficult for us to break down. I think once we um, increased the tempo at the start of the second half, we looked a different side. and. For half an hour, we're, we're, we're fantastic, we're excellent, I thought. Um, deservedly got two goals, and obviously when you can see goals change games, when you can see it gives them a little bit of impetus. And Although we're disappointed in the the, the award and the penalty, I'm not sure it was, it was a penalty. Um, ultimately, it's got them back in the game, and uh, you didn't have a sticky five minutes, but in fairness, I thought we saw out the game really, really well when it was when it was 3-2. I wouldn't like to say won, won comfortably, but we weren't at any point threatened. If any of the team were going to score, like, it was us going to go get a fourth and, rather than them get an equaliser. Uh, goal and assist and a yellow card for Danny Lloyd today here in an eventful game, to say the least. Yeah, I thought the, I thought the third goal was a great goal. Um, we asked them at half time, like I say, in terms of increasing the tempo that we moved the ball, and um, it's three really, really good passes that have got us a, got us a goal. Ben's obviously played out the Tom, he's fired a great ball into Adam. He's found a, a ball, I think, into Jamie, who's set Richie, and Richie's put a great ball in on Lloyd's score. So, fantastic goal. Um, in, terms of, in, in terms of Lloyd's performance, and he, he's come in, he's now got an opportunity in the fact that Barnes, he's, Barnes is injured, so he has to, uh, has to improve, he knows that. Um, there are signs that he's taken on board what we're asking him to do. He's it's still frustrating, which he he'll always will be. Um, but he's trying to he's trying to trying to learn, and he's I think he's scored seven goals now um, in possibly five or six starts. Although he has made a lot of, lot of appearances off off the bench, he's an opportunity now to like I say stake his claim and um, and stay in there. You mentioned Michael Barnes. Uh, can you tell us the extent of his injury? We're unsure. He's 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 done his he's tweaked his tweaked his groin. Um, First thoughts were it could be quite a, quite a bad one. I don't think it's as bad as we, as we first de- feared, but he'll certainly be out for for a couple of weeks. He's been a week now. Um, I'd suggest he'll probably be at least another another week or two. Um, we'll just have to see how he how he progresses. Um, if it doesn't um, improve as much as we we'd like, we might get him scanned. But at the minute, um, we'll see what happens. It, it, but like I say, he's, he, he's definitely going out for for a couple of weeks. Uh, Liam Thompson came out after half an hour. Uh, okay, so I came off today after half an hour. Uh, can you tell us anything about uh, potential injury for him? No, he just he got he got a whack on the back of the head um, from a a clearance a clearance came out. He's gone up for it, got a smash on the back of the head, and then from that was was being sick. Um, so nothing during the warm up, nothing pre match. He just was was, was sitting. Now whether that's a result of the of the of the knock on the head, we're not sure. Whether that's a result of him just being being ill or having a bug again, we don't know. But he was being sick on the pitch, so we obviously had to had to make a change. And um, Potsy came on, and it gives it gives him opportunity to stake his claim for a place. All right, thanks, Dave. Good luck on Tuesday against Stockport. Cheers.